Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder at CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to talk about how to deal with jealousy. Uh, if jealousy comes up in a really strong way in a relationship, it can completely destroy your relationship. It can destroy trust. It can um, just ruin everything for you. And so uh, it, here's how you can deal with it. Here are three things you can do. The first one is vitally important, and it is build a life away from your partner. And you might ask, you know, why is building a life away from my partner, you know, how does that connect to jealousy? And the thing is, is that most, uh, a lot of women that I talk to, they give themselves fully to a relationship. They're like, oh, I gave myself fully to him. Why doesn't he give himself fully to me? Well, giving yourself fully may seem like a really noble thing to do, but it's not healthy. There's nothing healthy about that. Um, and it's not attractive either. And so you need to have a life that's outside of your partner, that's completely separate. Have friends away from him, have activities away from him, have passions and things that you do away from him. It's way more attractive and it's way healthier. So the second thing you need to do is work on and deal with your insecurities. So insecurities can destroy a relationship. They can destroy your happiness. Um, and if you have really bad insecurities, it can be a huge problem. So, um, you know, work on uh, uh, getting rid of your insecurities as much as possible. Every, you know, everybody's got insecurities, but you can work on them and, and make it so that your insecurities aren't controlling you and that you just have these insecurities that come up once in a while and, and you know there's different programs and stuff you can go uh, and deal with that uh, from things like transformational training things like self-esteem training so places like landmark forum or PSI seminars or something like that all of those things they work on your insecurities so the third thing is to accept your feelings as a natural part of a relationship so uh, there's one thing where jealousy gets to the point where it becomes obsessive and you can't stop thinking about it and you know is he is he seeing somebody else what's he doing why is he talking to her you know and, and uh um that isn't healthy but uh knowing that a certain little bit of having jealousy can be healthy and just accepting that and letting letting go of needing to do anything because of it um that can be a really healthy way to embrace your jealousy and deal with it so that it's not controlling you anymore. So that's it for today. If you want uh, some resources on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take the quiz there. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.